All right. Uh, what were we? Oh, right. We were. All right. So we've got Cantlin shields, but that's not particularly useful. I need to stop cooking monster eggs because that might give us some options. Okay. Uh, let's go back. Let's go back to Terran Cognita for a second. Um, I want to go check if I can make any. Uh, what are you guys up to? I have no idea. Okay. Uh, I want to check this. What can we make? So we got crack shots, kaboom shots, all that good good stuff. So we got pressure plates, we got buttons. We got So pressure plates aren't going to do anything. So we can't do pressure plates or pistons. That's that's right out, which sucks. Button. Activates any appliances in the local area. So the one unfortunate part is this doesn't really help me either. Uh cuz I'd have to have a billion buttons that I'm pressing. Just have like an automated defense thing. Here's an interesting question. Okay, let's see if we can make this stuff. So we got a bunch of fortress blocks. Oh, wait, what? How do we make fortress blocks? Unless I have to do something special. To get fortress blocks, or... No, I don't get... What? Okay, so this doesn't have it. Mm. What about you? Capital, wood, nope. If the goal is to farm tickets, the spike floor with the floating mansion is ideal. Yeah, I figured. I just want to make something else. All right, fine. Spike floor, floating mansion, call it a, call it good enough. Okay, so let's go back to Terra Gladiatoria. Got plenty of food. We'll just start. We'll just cover the entire area in spikes for the time being. I've got a ton of them too. Now that I'm looking at it, wow. Okay. I guess realistically, let's uh let's do like a spiral outwards. Just so it's kind of the right size. This will make this will make my life a lot easier here. Okay. Yeah, so what I what I'm going to do is I'm just going to use up every bit of spike I possibly have. And then we're going to just build a, uh, a staircase elsewhere, going up to a floating mansion. Actually, really, what I can do is just make a, a nice little cottage in the corner of the map and just hang out there forever. I really wanted to make some kind of, like, uh, infinite, uh, infinite ridiculoso, like, murder-death machine, but sadly, we just can't do it. Uh, so instead... We're just going to we're just going to give in to defeat and go back with the the original true cheese. Of this run. Okay. Is that it? Yeah, that's it. What do we think? Can I do one more layer here? Probably not. So let's do a, a partial layer. Cause this will be Less costly, spike-wise. Okay. Yeah, the other option is we could do... Yeah, the problem is any kind of special wall is going to make it so they break the spikes. Which sucks, because I would really like it if they didn't break the spikes. So I could have, like, a nice little hut in the center. But no dice. Okay, whatever. Uh, do, do, do. Let's go find... I find where the edge of the world is. Huh. Interesting. So was that earlier? Oh right. I forgot my controllers. Yeah. I forgot my controllers about to run out of juice, supposedly. Okay. Oh you know what? Okay. We've actually gotta do this. Alright, uh, so, fun fact, the invisible... Okay, metallic trouble. We need magical tussle. 
I mean, I guess I might as well make uh, one of each of these and just burn through them, burn through them all. At some point, we got to figure out where we specifically can. Um... Let's see. We've also got to figure out specifically where to to farm more of these uh, these arena tickets. It'd be great if actually one of these challenges gave extra blank tickets here. But sadly, we're just about uh, we're just about all out of them. Okay. Anyway, uh, let's pop this and then let's go figure out where to build our hut. I'll start building the hut while we while we wait for the challenge to go. All right. Uh, where's this? This seems like a good spot for it. Okay. Here we go. I guess if I just spin, there we go. There's there's our answer. I'm just gonna make a tiny little hut over here. I guess what I should probably do is maybe make it a little bit closer. Do we want to do that? Nah. We'll just wait until the challenge is over. So I'll, I'll just make it out of. Um, I'll probably just make it out of. Block. Uh, mm, mm, mm. We got, we got, we don't have much for hardwood. Okay, well that's not really unfortunate or anything like that. Okay, uh, so I'm gonna start with stone walls. It's technically not flagstones, but whatever. Doesn't even need to be a big hut. Anyway, repelled by a strange. Strange forest, totally understandable. Okay. There we go. Yeah, really, we just want enough that I can put a, uh, my throne in. Oh, in retrospect, aren't thrones... Aren't thrones, uh, odd? Where's my throne? There it is. It might be odd width, so I might have to make it a little bit bigger. Yeah, it is. Okay, uh, I guess we're making this... A bit, bit larger than I thought. Thought we were originally going to. Oh, that's fine. Uh, let's just destroy our way through here. I'll just bring it out one more, and that'll be good enough. This will get rid of, also get rid of some resources that we weren't going to be using otherwise. Okay. There's probably, yeah, there's probably some kind of flying monster over there. Where's my car? There it is. We should probably go check them out. Maybe I should actually... Oh yeah, it's these guys. Maybe we should actually make our, our battle hut uh, nearby so I can kind of watch. Yeah, we should probably do it. Originally I was going to make things far away, but it's probably a better idea if we don't. Because yeah, this is too far away. Okay, let's let's watch the Power Yowies die. At what point did the Power Yowies disappear? Interestingly enough, they don't, so just certain enemies do. Well, I guess I'll just build this, and if we need to build another one, we'll build another one. Oops. Okay, see, now I can see. It's weird that I couldn't see him earlier. Maybe I just wasn't watching. But yeah, I don't want to build close enough that I can see their HP. Because that's inconvenient. Uh, because that means they're very liable to aggro on me. Oops. Okay, well, let's hop back in the car and go kill them. Ooh, Freesia flowers. Good stuff. I think that's also finest fur and maybe some other goodies. Snow? Eh. Don't care about the snow so much. Cedar saplings? Huh. The other option we could figure out is actually, uh... Where they spawn in. Okay, let's hang out for a second. Oh, never mind. Okay. Oh, we're not done yet. Question. Do they always spawn in?
within the bounds of the square. They do. Okay. That gives us another option. I don't know if they... I assume they prioritize me over getting to the center, which is a bit unfortunate. Because I'm thinking about it, it could actually be kind of interesting if we actually just put a giant wall around the entire outside. Uh, let's see. Building is a single layer of stone at the bottom. Also looks great, along with the corner logs. Huh! Yeah, I guess that would make sense. Okay. Well, let's bot. Uh, let's uh, let's hit the baleful. Uh, yep, ow. Uh, the baleful trouble one, and then I'm gonna go back to working on on this. Realistically, I was actually thinking of using um, fortress blocks. Okay. This way, if enemy enemy if any enemy does actually chase after me here, I can just repel them. Unfortunately, we don't have enough foundations here. I guess we'll do this. What is this For fortress battlement? Whatever. Doesn't look perfect, but it looks good enough. Okay, let's just do this. Uh, where's that cell door that I keep using? Oh, items bag is full. All right, uh, you get out of here. There we go. Oh, no. We needed that cell door, duh. Looks like we've got some flying baddies around here too. I'll have to go take care of them in a second. Yeah, the other option is, oh dude, I could do it. Oh, that's an interesting question. Maybe the answer is simpler than I thought. I could. And I'd have to test this. No, that probably it probably wouldn't work. Hmm. I was thinking, it could be really interesting almost if I had a. Uh, uh, it could be really interesting if I actually had a cannon pointed at, at this from somewhere. I'd really like to know the maximum range on this thing. Like right here. Can I do it from right here? How far does it shoot? Pretty far, not far enough. Huh. Because if I could actually have a cannon like right here, maybe, ooh, on top of a small fortress. Because they seem to spawn in on the other side of this. Okay, hold on. I'm going to go, I'm going to go destroy my, uh, my little battle hut. We got one more key. I like, I like the idea of this right now. But what I could do, very potentially, is have a small fort with a cannon on top, and I just use that instead. I'd like to be at least a little bit active. Uh, a little bit of an active participant in this. Anyway. I do feel a little bit bad because we have, like, zero idea what half of these challenges look like. But honestly, it's just the same... It's the same monsters that we've been fighting this entire game. So at this point, I'm maybe a little bit, uh, I guess, desensitized, desensitized to the idea of challenge. And I'm just building instead of... Uh, I'm building to cheese instead of anything else. I'll, I'll probably make uh, make my little, like, uh, you know, relaxy hut out here. Maybe I'll make a... a something. I don't know. I'll figure it out. Anyway, uh, yeah, this is, this is probably a good spot. As good of a spot as any. Put this away for a second. Let's sort. Let's grab these. At some point, I'll I'll farm the necessary resources. And there we go. Never mind. Or right, Helcom Fort, Fort and Battle Hut for backup. Yeah, probably. All right. So we got Newts, Ruby, and oh hey, some more battlements. Nice stuff. Okay. So here's what I'm gonna do. Oops. I'm gonna destroy. Let 
having the worst time placing these. There we go. Okay, so I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna place these. So effectively, what this is going to be is a glorified nothing hut with a lower level with this in it. Uh, let's see. I guess I'll bring it out one more. The blocks seem to uh, support the ability for me to do that. Did I get? Did I get more? Or is th no, this hut is just smaller. Okay, that's fine. All right. So then we're gonna try this. Okay. So yeah, instead of put it, placing my battle hut at the center, like I have been, we're gonna move the battle hut out here. Put a cell door in, uh, put a earth block there. Okay, oh, I did not place this particularly well. Okay, there we go. We get this. Um, Part of it is I don't know how high it needs to be, so this will be fine for the time being. Okay, let's do that. And then we've got battlements. Hmm. It doesn't need to be too tall, I think. Actually, the, the easiest way to test, actually... Oops. These, the easiest way to see if it's too tall or not is actually to uh, place the cannon where I was going to place the cannon to begin with. Okay, here. And let's see if it hits the dead center. No, it's too far! Okay. Because, yeah, this, this only needs to be as tall as... really inconvenient. Okay, this only needs to be as tall as I need to hit dead center on that thing. We're just gonna let them sit there as uh, sitting ducks. And nothing more. Okay. Okay, so we, we want ladder, ladder, ladder. There we go. Okay. And yeah, having it overshoot maybe just a little bit is actually probably a good idea. Okay. Perfect. Okay, so we, now we've got the the ultra crappy no no bells, no whistles. All right, maybe a little bit further back. Cannon hut. Yeah, that's that's probably far uh, far enough back. That's a good idea. Well, yeah, we could move it even further back. Well, either we'll move the hut or move the full cannon. We'll find out. We'll find out in a bit. I'd like to try the last round with this because, as we found out, the. Uh, As far as I found out, Cannon Hut here uh, should be impenetrable. The only worry is if uh, monsters specifically get really aggressive about trying to get at me. Here. I could build a moat. Could work. Good work. Okay, uh... T -t 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 -t. I got plenty of grass seed. I might as well grab one out uh, just so it looks decent. Okay, there we go. Perfect. Not a big fan of that uh, ladder placement. I guess the other option is... Actually... Let's do that. I'm gonna move the ladder to the outside. 
This way, we have a lot more space. Okay, there we go. And then I'm gonna put battlements. I'm gonna put battlements in every corner. I think we've also got, like, crenellations and stuff that we could do, too. I could also just surround the entire outside with this stuff. But... There we go. Okay, perfect. Battle Hut is a go. Okay. Because, yeah, I know I can move the, uh... I know I can move the hut back and stuff like that. But this is okay. Okay, so I'm just going to hang out here for the time being. Alright, let's see if this shoots the way I want it to. The answer is no. Crap. Okay. Oh. Okay. Interesting point. They really don't care about me. Which is almost heartbreaking. But it does mean that... Wait, where'd the Death Scorpions go? Oh, they, they died, of course. Duh. Okay. Um... So I'm just gonna put a ladder here. Okay. And let's bring this whole thing back. I'll have to redesign it later. Let's see if it hits them. Unfortunately, I think I think we're running into an interesting issue. Whereas, if it's too far away, they simply won't. Um, it simply won't shoot at them. No, it got him. Unfortunately, they. Uh, no. Yeah, it's getting them. It's getting them, but it's it's not worth the effort. Okay. Uh, no, it might actually be worth the effort. It almost killed them. Yeah, part of the problem is we can't see their HP particularly well. Makes it a little bit harder. Oh, boss trolls. Alright, hold on. Uh... Got all these shrubs to get out of my inventory, because apparently my spikes are gone. Uh, I'll keep that for a second. Let's get rid of the rest of this stuff. We're not using it. Uh, spikes, 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 spikes. Where'd they go? There they are. Right. Probably shouldn't bother putting those down if these guys are going to be here. Alright, whatever. Yeah, so we gotta we gotta put the uh, we gotta put the cannon further back. The spikes seem to do most of most of the work. Oh, monster eggs! Yes. Okay, we needed those badly. So we gotta, we still gotta figure out a reasonable means. Oh. Huh. Well, that's in it. Mm, e, mm, e? Hmm. I don't know. Okay. Well, I need to, I need to kill these guys. So part of it is I don't like the cannon because it breaks my spikes. Kind of wish it wouldn't. Life would be a lot easier if it didn't. And I mean, realistically, yes, I could actually just rely on... I could actually just rely on the spikes to kill almost everything for me. Hmm. 
Okay, we got a blank ticket, but it's not doing me any uh it doesn't do me any good. Okay, so let's let's try something different. Okay, so I got some extra monster eggs there, which is actually super handy. Cause we can potentially do some things with that. Okay, uh Cause yeah, I can't take it into the ground. Which makes this a little bit harder. I really wish I could just move the teleport circle. But no dice. Okay, uh, so we've got these crappy shrubs. We've got some other stuff. Uh, let's just put all this stuff away for a little while. Okay, so Bash Mobile, we st our cannon's still back there. Uh, let's grab the evil idols. Huh. Interesting problem. I might actually only be able to have three of them. Well, uh, let's get back up here for a second. Let's make some evil idols. I guess I might as well make as many as, as I want, or as I can. The one problem is they'll get stuck. I'd like to make more, but for the time being, we'll just have four. Question, can I jump over them? No, we really need to get the, uh... Wait, actually, alternate idea. Better alternate idea. I don't know if this would work. So let's try this. Because this will make cleaning up after them so much easier. Though I'm technically going to take damage putting them down. Whatever. Close enough. Alright, I don't know if this works. But that, um, that might actually solve us some consternation. And if it doesn't work, then we'll do some other things. Can you ladder out? Nope. Uh, you can't build off the top, uh, bottom of them, sadly. Okay. So we're actually done with all of these. So I gotta, I gotta go back up. Slimy Tussle. I really do not ha know how many... Yeah, I'm running out of blank tickets. So we gotta figure out how to farm them somehow. Hopefully, the end of this. Maybe. Well, let's try Stony Trauma for the time being. Well, we'll find it quick. And we can always move in with the, uh... We can always move in with the... Bashmobile. Oh, time to run. To figure it out. Eventually, what we... Uh, what I'm gonna do is just have a... Some kind of cube? I'm trying to think. I guess... No, that wouldn't work. Oh, shit. It's timed. That's worrying. Let's see. Have a bunch of evil idols. Coming in from the outside. Uh. Could work. Might not. Okay, we got a whopping needle. Oh, cool. I need one of those. Okay, so it looks like there is a time limit, but it's not nearly as bad as you think it would be. Alright. Here's a question. Okay. Yeah, so we gotta have the evil idols pointed inwards. Uh, we gotta make sure there's enough room for golems to get through, though. That's part of the reason why I didn't even bother. With it. Originally. I'm a little bit curious if I'm explosion proof in this thing. I should test this. I don't know. You can treat this as a tower defense game. What do you think I've been doing? 100% tower defense for me. Okay, uh, phase three, golems. So, interesting point, these are actually back to basic enemy types, sort of. So, like, um, 
We're back to basic golems. Yeah, okay. I think I have some ideas of how I can get this working. For next time. That time limit is punishing, though. So pretty much, I'm going to have to be an active participant for the next uh, couple sections. I'm going to take out the... Uh, I'm going to take out the... The... Uh, evil idols. Not immediately. I have, I have ideas. Okay, let's see what we get. Please tell me I get uh, extra tickets. Just one? Really? Then why even bother doing that one? Apart from like... Oh, we did get a lot of rock bomb shards and Ori Halcom. Okay, I will give it, give it that. Let's see, am I ever gonna play Unholy Heights again? I could. I actually really liked Unholy Heights. I just didn't understand it at the time, and then I lost my save file, so I'd have to start over. But I could, I could play that game again. The problem is like, uh, time. I've, I have too many. I have too many series going on at once, and I really got to finish some of them. Luckily, uh, I've, I think I've mentioned this, um, I'm pretty dang close to actually finishing this series, in my opinion. Like, we still got stuff that we can do. We could build up the town, we could do a lot of things. But after a certain point, I kind of lose the... I lose the motivation to do so. Okay, so this is gonna this is gonna be our last arena one, and then I'm gonna have to figure out where to farm these. Well, let's do frightening trauma. Oh yeah, we're gonna make the ticket, and then I'm gonna go see if I can. Uh, we're gonna go see if I can upgrade this. So, immediate problem with last time. Uh, the golems break these way too easily. That's a problem. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to make it bigger. I'm going to spread them out a little bit. I think dudes should be able to get through. Yeah, that's perfect. Okay. Yeah, so they should be able to congregate, congregate in the center. But if I do this... That should work. Okay. So then what I'm going to do... Is have more. So we got extra spikes. You can always make more too. So I'm just going to have that be there for the time being. Um... This will make it look nice. There we go. Yeah, sadly, I don't have enough monster eggs to make any more sets, but this is fine. All right, frightening trauma. Let's see. Could always switch this to a rainy day series. So once a week or one or two hour episode, just building the best town on the islands you can. This is a good point. I don't think I'd ever build up any of the islands, though. I think it would just be me screwing around and making a town. Okay, I should probably actually let these guys work. Nah. I two-shot them. I think... Oh, you know what? The reason the reason why you want to do these is because the rewards are better. Because I'm getting a heck of a lot more fortress blocks from these dudes. Okay. Didn't realize these guys would show up. Fancy carpet blocks. Uh-oh. They're teleporting on me. That's a worry. Not too big of a worry, but still. Yeah, wow, we've... We've just gotten... Everything. Okay, I'm gonna stand on the other side. I just want to see this happen. Okay, so they're taking damage. They can get in, but they kind of can't get in. So they get stuck, they flub around a bunch. We're gonna need more spikes, and we're gonna need more... We're gonna need more traps. But that's okay. Wait! It's a green dragon that walks! 
Wait, slime skin? What the hell? All right. Yeah, so the green dragons do walk, despite all evidence to the contrary. Okay. Yeah, so it looks like the setup is actually perfect. We're gonna need more though. We just gotta do some more things. Okay, the only other confirmed source uh, for tickets is... ...is fishing, but it's slow. Alright. That's not great. Well, we're gonna have fortress blocks for days. That's fun. I gotta figure out a use for them. Okay. Luckily, only a couple of green dragons are showing up here. And we're killing them more than fast enough. As opposed to the... Oh man, now that I'm remembering the really awkward, painfully slow experience of trying to kill a dragon uh, back in the previous part of the game. Oh man. Do you guys... I hope I hope some of you guys remember that because that was I was really proud of that actually killing the dragon Back in the demo. That was a really cool. I actually really wish there were more games like that actually Okay Well, that's immediately disconcerting to have but I guess it's not a big big deal to leave because I can just Yeah, I'm fireproof awesome Yeah Okay, so the the sad part is we are totally out of tickets. I've got one left. That's stupid. I shouldn't have to grind to do the most interesting part of this. I don't even see if I have one left. Yeah, there it is. There is the singular ticket. I mean, they're not that uncommon. I just have to reset some islands. But still, pain in the butt. Don't want to have to do that. We're going to have to anyway. And, of course, our inventory is full. Let's see if I can cook anything. Let's see, why am I called Dude? Uh, it's a funny name. Plus, uh, it's the Dutch word for death and a lot of other things, really. Okay, so we need wheat. Can I do fruit salad? I guess I'll make a fruit salad. Yeah, so we're going to need to go get our hands on... Uh, We're probably going to have to get our hands on uh, spicy stuff, probably. Fries. We could also do farming, maybe. I don't know. I guess I don't care too much. Let's see. Can you replace blocks in the Grand Square? No, sadly. The uh, Grand Square uh, is totally untouchable, which sucks. I have some ideas. Oh, interesting. I can come walk... Straight through this. I guess it makes sense, but still. Okay. Yeah, so... Yeah, we're gonna have to start resetting islands. I guess I'll do some uh, decorative stuff and maybe figure some things out. I'll figure out building the rest of this. I, I kind of want to build, like, uh, down and take a turn or do some other thing. I don't know. I'll figure that part out. Uh, for the time being, though, let's save. We got another Powy Yowie. Why do we? Why is it nothing but Powy Yowies around here? It's really weird. All right, whatever. 